Is the world of tomorrow in an AI world more centralized or more decentralized? It's, it's probably going to wind up at least economically being more decentralized. I think we're all going to become gig folks in some capacity or another. I think as we know work today, it'll be radically different in the future. It's going to be hopefully more flexible, more on demand, but it's going to be more you know, knowledge, skill-based than anything else and where we can actually apply that. Societally, I think, though, we might have become more centralized. The need for a common, you know, call it baseline for ethics and morals, that's going to force some level of centralization. The other thing is, given what we're doing with artificial intelligence and freeing up some time, actually gives us a unique opportunity to explore our own humanity, to understand what it means to be human, the human condition, you know, and to teach machines some of these concepts means that we have to really understand what they mean. For example, there's an initiative called Loving AI, where there's a group of people based primarily out of Africa that are trying to see, can we teach a machine about unconditional love, right? Well, how do you do that? I mean, how do you teach a child unconditional love? That means we really have to understand what is love and how does it work and what does unconditional and unconditional mean and it really forces us to understand like what, what do we mean, what's the human experience, what's the human psyche around here and by doing that we might actually be becoming more human by going through that whole thought process.